在杜代维涛讲报的，是来的 multicam p i e r c configuration m u l t i c a m five。M580 is a very powerful. It's already use internet to communication. Let's start first. We build. We choose the Modica M580. It's 4040. It's always use remote I/O by Ethernet link light, so it's very powerful. It's very modern for system. Here, look. If you build configuration, this one is M five eighty the forty forty. It has the this remote I O connection remote I O. Here the remote I O bus. We click here. We can build the remote and open. We need rack. We choose eight slot back plan. Okay, we. Power supply. We choose the power supply. That this one is I O E I O bus. Is the remote I O bus? Is the remote distribution I O or this here? Is all we use the Ethernet internet to communication here? Okay, this. Program we just、uh, emulate. So if you use exactly communication with the PLC, is、uh, if your laptop to connect、uh, is PLC, use this one USB. Okay, this one USB, USB port. If you choose the First, you choose standard model. Here, if you choose standard model, is USB PLC. If you choose this simulation, we will choose here. So. If you choose PLC, look at this mark PLC. Is use you can use USB connected to PC. So communication with the with PLC. Okay. Now today we choose the simulator. Okay. Here connection. This one connection is a bus. This one here bus is main IP address is PLC main PLC IP address. This IP address A this one is the is remote I O scanned address. Okay, we can. 
communication. We choose the one local input collection to remote output. Okay. Input, we choose this one on the EIO bus. This one is the EIO bus, is the IP address, is 192.168.11.2. Okay, all the we can choose the output module. Output body DD2 Okay And can we can create a second one remote IO which is four We use the power supply, we choose the here. This is CRA312 is adapted. So we choose other output. Here is the IP address is different, is 11.3, okay? That's it. Now we can do communication and make the program. First, we, we should take, how to find tag is completely different in the sled as the PLC. This one we choose take. We use DVCDDT. We choose the go to detail. This one is the digit. Okay, we choose this one. And the import. This is start. Is start. This alias. Okay. We choose stop. Okay. This lock is connection start stop push button. And the control remote IO, we use two remote IO is a two model. Is one model named the this remote IO. This one is. Motor one. Okay. Okay, we could use the choose other one motor two. Here is the DUI, means the distribution remote I remote first one rack. The D2 remote second one rack. Second one is on this output. Auto 2. That's it. Okay. 
Okay, now we can program. We choose the start button. This one is uh, exactly direct DTT tag. Here is S1. Here. So we could do use, uh, we just use the any start. Stop. Here is a set. Five seconds is the mode. Mode two. First of all, after five seconds, mode two is wrong. Okay, we use the branch.
both one okay this is the last time okay that's it this simple start start push start button the time on is motor one is on after five seconds motor two is on we just uh, show you how to communication with sushi motor I if you are doing this job first we should uh, Here we should make sure he's able. Okay, we use emulation first. Yeah. Okay. First, analyzer is no zero. No error, okay. It's working. We use uh, simulation, the connection. Transfer to that. Transfer to PLC. This one is exactly exactly is IO terminal. So you have to use false value. Okay, no. His motor one is on in the motor one in the remote IO. Five second remote motor two in the remote IO second one. Second remote IO is on. Okay. That's it. This keyword is there. Not difficult, but keyword just use how to configuration. How to configuration this the IO you will use device DTT to con con configuration is there. Oh, so we can use the direct is address, but we must use alias. Okay, and this way, EIO bus, SNET remote distribution, IO bus. Okay, thank you very much.